Dating can be hard and sometimes it's easy to make mistakes that will cause the date to go off the rails, losing any potential a budding relationship might have. Therefore, to try and avoid you ever having to experience this scenario, we look at 5 basic rules of dating you need to apply. Number 1. Be decisive When you meet someone it's important to go in with confidence and certainty of what you want to do, regardless of gender. The truth is, in traditional dating rules, the man is meant to be decisive and should take the lead as to what occurs during the date or where they should go. While this quality is still attractive, the social and cultural norms and dating rules of today mean that you can just be much more open to what you want to do and share ideas on what to do, but ultimately ensure you don't dither and just make a decision. The same goes for the date itself don't hesitate to ask questions, assuming they're appropriate and have an open conversation, without worry about looking for moments or openings that may never occur. Number 2. Don't overthink Understanding your psychology is hard, understanding the psychology of someone you know is extremely hard, and understanding the psychology of someone you've barely met is close to impossible. Therefore, it's best not to stress yourself about trying to understand every minute detail or action someone makes during a date. In part, this is because a date can be hard enough as you're keen to make a good impression and get to learn about someone else, so this only makes it more challenging to juggle more emotions and thoughts. Instead of working to your benefit, it will only likely work against you as you don't show your true and natural self which is also the version of you that is most confident and happy. Number 3. Give your full attention If you're going out with a friend and they keep taking their phone out to check messages and reply to others, it's likely to get a little annoying as it would be deemed as rude. On a date, that feeling is amplified, because not only is it a rude gesture, but it can also cause people to start questioning whether you like spending time with them and feeding insecurities. More so, it can be extremely frustrating to others if you're spending time focused on other people as much as the person you're supposedly dedicating time to. So refrain from pulling out your phone, as while the odd occasion will be fine, routinely checking it will not go down well, and instead focus on your date which will be all the more appreciated. Number 4. Listen Listening is a great skill to have and let's be clear, I'm not just talking about hearing what other people are saying here, which should be a given. Instead, work to give opportunities to have a balanced and meaningful conversation, trying to give opportunities for your date to speak about themselves. The fact is, not only does this make you appear as a more active listener, it's the key point in learning about someone new to you, and learning about your compatibility. More than that, it gives you insight about them on a personal level, which might be of value later on, such as buying a personal gift because you remembered them speaking about something they wanted on a date. Number 5. Don't play games if you want a relationship with someone then simply put, playing games isn't going to help and is actually likely to work against you. People often say to wait a few days after a date to text or call, or trying to use psychological tricks to your advantage to try and make the other person like you more. The truth is, more often than not these games don't work and are significantly more likely to work against you not only as people don't enjoy their emotions being toyed with, but because it's mentally exhausting for both people. Instead trust your intuition, which is often quite accurate in how to judge a situation after years of evolution, and just be genuine and true to yourself, it'll make it easier to actually enjoy the date. Are you going to or have applied any of the rules discussed? Let me know in the comments section below. Please like, share and subscribe as we help you live life on your terms. Don't forget to hit the bell icon to ensure YouTube notifies you of the latest uploads. Thanks for watching.